All right, in this video I'm going to show you how to run a three-way switch. This will be one of my switch boxes. This will be my other switch box. I'm going to run this light. And in this video I'm going to run power from my panel box into this switch box. Then I'm going to run the switch leg into this light box. And then I'm going to run my three wire over to this box. Okay. So the first thing we need to do is put the power wire into this box. Okay, this is the one we go to the panel box or another out come from another box. Okay. Then we're going to take a piece of wire and we're going to run it. into the light box. So I'll put this one on the inside so that I know that it's my switch leg. All right, so I've got my power coming in. I've got my switch leg running over here. Now the last thing I need is I need a piece of three wire to go between these two boxes. So I'm going to put my piece of three wire from this box and then I'm going to put it into the switch box. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is this switch right here. This one's the easy one. You have three screws or lugs on a three-way switch, and you have three wires coming into this box. You got the red, the black, and the white. The ground doesn't count. All right, so all I have to do is strip the wire Cut it to about six inches, strip about three quarters of an inch off, I'm going to then put my loops on the ends. Then install my three-way switch. Okay, so I have the black and the red, and then I have the white wire. One of these three wires has to be the switch leg. So I'm going to use the white as the switch leg. I'm going to use the black and the red as they should be as the travelers. So I'm going to look at my three-way switch. I've got two screws that are across from each other. Those are the two wires I'm going to get attached to these red and the black. So I put the red by itself on the side where there's no other screw. Then I put its companion black wire across from it. Always remember that in order for a three-way switch to work, these traveler wires have to be across from each other and they have to be the same on both switches. Okay. Next I will use this white wire, which will be my switch leg. And of course, you have to attach your ground wire. Then fold it into the box. Okay? Now, the light is simple black to black, white to white. Pretty simple. So I'm not going to do the light. Now over in this box, I have a staple to hold that wire in place. Let me get a staple. Okay. 
Okay, so I have my, this is going to be my switch leg running to my light. This is my traveler wire. And then, of course, the other wire is my hot wire. So the first thing I do is strip all of the wires. You have all the wires stripped. Again, the first thing I like to do is put all the grounds together. This time I have three grounds, so I'm going to wrap two, two of them around one. Use my linesman's pliers to get a nice tight wrap. Cut off two of the excess wires. Then I'm going to install my green wire nut. Make sure you tighten it, tighten it down so it's snug. Cut it to about six inches. Then you fold it to get it out of your way. All right, next you're gonna move on to your neutral wires. Okay, now, this wire coming out of this traveler is not a neutral wire. That I'm gonna make into a switch leg but the other two will be my neutrals. Neutral coming in from the panel box and going up to the light. So those are my neutrals. So all I have to do in a switch box for this switch is wire nut the two wires together. So now I have neutral coming in and going up to my other light, or my light, not the other light fold them into the box, okay? Now, the next thing I need to do is I need to get the switch leg from here over to here. So that... Okay, so I have my neutral wires hooked and stuffed into the box. Now I need to get my switch leg. The switch leg comes down out of this box, then it's going to jump to the white wire because I used it as my switch leg over here. So I'm going to take the black wire from the switch leg wire and hook it to the white wire coming out of the three wire, which will take it over there. All I have to do is cut and strip it, put a wire nut on it, and stuff it in the box. So now the switch leg is coming down going through the white wire into and over here to this switch. Okay, so that leaves my three wires coming out of this box. I have the black wire that's going to be my hot wire. I have the two wires that are going to be my travelers. So remember that the switches have to be the same. So I'm going to take the red wire and put it on the gold screw that's on the side by itself. Then I'm going to take its companion traveler and put it across from it on the other gold screw. That way both switches are set up the same way. Red to the side by itself, gold to the side, or the black wire to the side where's the two lugs. And the last thing I have to do, make this, is put the hot wire onto the black screw. And, of course, hook up the ground.
Then you just have to get all of those wires stuffed into the box. Okay? So, this is a three-way switch where the power and the switch leg are in the same box. So that this box only has one wire coming into it. Okay? Single or three-way switch, power and switch leg into the same box.